Hi everyone, it's Nicole Dennis here and I just wanted to share some really important things about your attitude and mindset as you get started to build your business with a seer. So something that's really important to remember is you're looking to identify and refer us to people who want to do something right now. They either want to build a residual income stream or they want to become a customer and get fantastic transformational results using a seer's incredible products. So doing a business like this can be a little bit like an emotional roller coaster. You know, we can have a good day, we can have a bad day, and, and everything kind of in between. So this is really, really important to remember as you get started that it is going to be a little bit like a roller coaster. You're going to, you're going to, your goal is to identify people who want to do something right now. So just keep focused on that. So what we've figured out is that no matter what you do in life, there's always a few types of people. So most of you may have figured out by now you cannot really change people. So with this business, we don't want to take the approach that we're trying to convince anybody or change their minds. And I'm going to just show you an example of apples so that you can kind of understand how there, there are three different types of people and what types of people you're looking for with a seer. So red apples, these people are positive, they're open-minded and they're willing to try new things. They usually say yes to everything. In this business, the whole key to success is to spend 95% of your time looking for and talking to people who are like red apples. It sounds really silly, but it's a simple way to remember what you're, what you're trying to do to be successful. By the time you're around 18 years old, you already know a thousand people. So think about everyone you know. Do you know at least a few red apples? People who are happy, easygoing, who are successful in things that they do? Okay, so now let's move on to the next type of apple, the green apple. These people have a lot of questions and they need to get their questions answered before they, before they will do something. So if you can answer their questions, you can go ahead and do that. But it might be better to just point them to a tool or perhaps connect them with someone who knows more about a seer than you do to get their questions answered. So, you know, you answer their questions and then you, and then see if they want to, you know, do something with a seer. And then, of course, there are rotten apples, okay? So these people, maybe they're like the kind of people that are negative. They're always down on everything. They kind of like say no to new opportunities and things like that. So these people, you're probably not going to be able to change them. So, you know, you can still care for them. You can still be friends with them. They can still be in your family, but they're just probably not going to be part of your ASEA business. So you just want to remember to spend 95% of your time focused on those red apples. So as you go about this, you're going to find all kinds of people, green apples, rotten apples, and red apples. The key is to keep searching for people and to really find and identify those red apples who you're really going to want to work with. So it's pretty simple. Find red apples. Who will find other red apples? This is just a simple way to understand the mindset that you're wanting to be working with as you go about and start to build your ASEA business. The goal, of course, is for you to create an ASEA tree full of lots of red apples. Now, these red apples, because of the type of people they are, they're positive, they have a great attitude, they have influence over their networks, and they are going to be able to be the ones who are going to get this transformational health technology into the hands of more people. So anyway, I hope that was a useful little introduction to the mindset and attitude that you need to have as you start to build your ASEA business.